In this video, I am going to do an unboxing and review of the Franklin Planner Ivy Simulated Leather Snap Binder in the color Jade. All of the items shown in this video can be found by expanding the description area underneath this video and clicking on the link. Also, you can save money on the FranklinPlanner.com website by using discount promo code Tanya Plans. I was excited to get this color because I thought it would be different from any other color that I had. This video is not sponsored by Franklin Planner. They sent it to me to do an honest review. Now as you can see on the tag here, this is the classic size Ivy Simulated Leather Snap Jade Binder and it has one and a half inch rings, which I'm really excited about because in my current binder I have the Gingham Farm binder right now. And with that binder, the rings are 1.25 inches. The rings on this binder is slightly larger at one and a half inch rings. So I'm excited for that. Oh, now this is a great color for the spring. And let me give you a close up here. It's like, uh, the color is called Jade. So it's a, a type of green and it has white polka dots on it. And again, this is the soft simulated leather give you a close-up here and as you can see this is a snap binder so snap meaning whoop, here's a little gel packet snap meaning uh, you can snap it shut to keep your plan secure I just want you to take a good look at the workmanship here it's very very nice very soft I like the way it feels this is the back Again, I love the polka dots. It's so retro. I love it. This is the spine. And let's open her up. So coming right out the box, it lays pretty flat. And once I have my paper in it, I never have a problem with their binders laying flat. As you can see here, there are two pen loops, one on the front flap another on the back flap and on the back of the pen loops are elastic so that way if you have fat ink pens or skinnier ink pens I've never had a problem with the fatter ink pens going into these loops and I like that there is elastic there as you can see here is a secretarial pocket and it has card slots we have one two three four card slots and there is the Franklin Covey name embossed there I really really like this. This is uh, a limited edition binder so they won't be making these forever. This binder also comes in two additional colors which are the teal and the watermelon colors. Right here is a document pocket where you can put papers in or stickers or whatever you would like there. Let me just take out the packaging here. And I like that this binder actually comes with the page lifters. Not all binders do, but page lifters help protect your plans so that your pages don't get rattled and wrinkled, the ones that are on the front and in the back of your planner. I love, love, love page lifters. And as you can see, these page lifters are black. They're made of a harder plastic material. And there is the Franklin Covey name embossed there. And here is the tag. Again, this is the classic size Ivy Simulated Leather Snap Binder in Jade. And the rings are one and a half inches. So I'm going to open the rings here. No, the rings felt really tight. And let me give you a close up of the rings and just to show you how tightly closed they are. And this is important because even if you have the smallest gap in your rings, your pages can get stuck while you're turning them. So these rings are nice and tight, which I like. So let's do some measurements. Okay, I have a ruler here, and as you can see, 
these are one and a half inch rings and they are slightly bigger than this is my gingham farm uh, floral binder here I love this pattern oh it's gorgeous but in this binder the rings are 1.25 inches it's kind of hard for me to show you because my papers are in here but what I was finding with this binder I love 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 this binder but I carry daily planner pages as well as weekly planner pages here in the back as you see as well as some other tabs and information and sometimes like right now it's turning great but when I get like for example to the beginning of my binder see how it's harder to turn the pages because it's just too full on one side so I'm hoping the extra rings that I get in this binder is exactly what I need I think this is going to be exactly the size I need so that I can turn pages no matter if I'm in the front or the back of my plan or in the middle that I can turn the pages more easily so I'm really really excited about that so let's look at the dimensions here so in height it is nine and a half inches high in width it is 8.25 inches now let's weigh the binder I like to weigh my binders when I do product reviews because to some people the weight of a binder is important to them now keep in mind that this binder has these thick sturdy page lifters so that's going to add to the weight here so this binder with the page lifters weighs 1.3 ounces. So I'm going to take the page lifters out because some people may not want page lifters in their binder. And let's see how much it weighs without that. Now I must tell you, I have reviewed a lot of Franklin Planner binders and the quality, this feels top notch. You guys, this really feels like a very nice quality binder. It's very soft it feels sturdy there's something upscale about this binder now without the page lifters it weighs one pound one ounce so the page lifters does make a couple of ounce difference okay so now I'm going to move my items into this new binder I'm so excited I'm just putting my planner pages in here now some of the things that I am carrying in my planner I actually carry four months of the original daily planner in my planner Franklin planner recommends you only need three months which is the current month the prior month and the future month but I like to carry as many months as possible in my planner and with these larger rings I will be able to do so again I also carry a weekly planner in my planner I use the daily planner which is a day on two pages for all of my personal and my day job I work full-time outside of the home and for planning my YouTube videos like these are the tabs for the weekly planner and these are the tabs I don't know if you can see for the daily planner I'll show you that in a minute but I plan my YouTube videos on the weekly planner in the back but this oh my gosh this is so much better I can tell already so just to show you okay so these are my this is my monthly view for my daily planner pages so I use this for my personal information for my work information I put that on my daily planner pages and in the back is my YouTube content information so I plan out my YouTube videos and I plan what I'm going to put on social media and I can tell already that the larger rings are very helpful because as you can see I'm in the beginning of the planner and the planner pages are not like together as they were in my uh, gingham farm planner because the rings were smaller So if you have a question, feel free to put it in the comments underneath this video and your question could be featured in my next video. Please be sure to like this video. This is Tanya helping you feel more organized so this can be your best year yet. Take care.